Hi, I'm Sean O'Kane with Ship Estimate TV, where we bring you the latest trends and information in IP and semiconductor design in the EDA industry. We're at the TSMC OIP Ecosystem 2016. Join me as we talk to a number of partners who have collaborated with TSMC on ultra-low power IoT platforms and subsystems. Hi everybody, Sean O'Kane here with Chip Estimate TV. With me today is Navraj Nandra, Senior Director of Marketing Analog Mixed Signal IP with Synopsys. Thank you very much for joining us again. Uh, it's great to see you again. Likewise, great to see you, Sean. I mean, every year we, we do this. Right. Um, let me just jump right in. Let's talk about IoT. So, it, it, it's estimated by the year 2020 there'll be billions of devices, maybe 30 billion devices. 50 uh, billion is what 50 I 50 billion. Yeah. Oh, uh, well, let's, let's just keep going. <laughs> Connected uh, in the IoT environment. So, Synopsys just recently entered the IoT market with Bluetooth technology. Right. So, talk a little bit about that progress. Yeah, in terms of the wireless connectivity, uh, it appears that uh, Bluetooth is, is, is an emerging standard. So, a lot of our customers enabling Bluetooth on their devices, uh, need to have some kind of wireless um, protocol. Mm -hmm. um, Bluetooth uh, 4.2, uh, moving to Bluetooth 5, um, seems to be the standard that people are adopting. And mm -hmm. so uh, they want the radio and the um, digital Mac or the protocol there. And so we're supporting both pieces to give a complete solution to our customers. Very nice. So uh, talk a little bit about Synopsys and TSMC, the collaboration at seven nanometer IP. Right, with these advanced nodes, uh, it's, it's very important to have uh, a strong foundry relationship or a partnership. And clearly, you know, TSMC and Synopsys um, uh, personifies that uh, at seven nanometers. And uh, we've been releasing um, seven nanometer foundation IP, um, logic libraries and standard cells. Uh, we're also in the process of releasing some of our complex interface IP, like HDMI, USB, PCI Express, DisplayPort. Mm -hmm. So, in fact, by you know the end of this year, early next year, we're going to have a full complement of seven nanometer IP on TSMC's technologies, both for mobile applications and also for high performance computing. So, um, last year when we we chatted, we briefly touched on Synopsys and TS, uh, TSMC that collaboration to develop the integrated IoT platform for 40 nanometer. That said, why is the 40 nanometer process gaining more traction in IoT? Yeah, well, one of the key reasons is the fact that it's ultra low power. And um, typically with these applications, wearables for example, um, battery consumption is of key importance. Mm -hmm. And so the ultra low power gives you that uh, capability in the process. Then of course the IP vendors want to make sure that the IP works in that ultra low power process. And so the uh, reason for that success, uh, or reason for that being adopted in IoT, is for that for that reason. Oh, fantastic. So, it's uh, again uh, great seeing you again and uh, catching us up uh, on uh, on uh, all the collaboration with TSMC and Synopsys. So, for Navraj Nandra, my name is Sean O'Kane. We'll see you next time on see you Ship. Next year. Yes, <laughs> Ship Estimate TV. Oh, TV. Yes. <laughs> cool.